Okay, so if you watch part, the last part, she said I was mean beating up Morgan Freeman. Yeah, that is mean. But then she gives me a kiss off camera. Yeah. You don't want to fight them? I mean, I can, I guess. For Let's focus on experience. Let's be. Chaos. When, I would say when you get to mid game is when I like stop. That's fair. You're making a big mistake messing with Cunin, Why is that Okay, what's up, Scott, your kid? Which one? The one that walked past. Uh oh. That's going to leave some scars. Let's mess with some physics. Now you see me? Ow! You can't kill, but you can't see. I heed Chaos's call. Yeah! <laughs> Our brutalist is getting brutalized. Pandemonium! Oh, I'm up? Okay. <laughs> Good thing I always thought I was going Happen yeah. to change your mind, Super Craig? He says I changed my mind. Let's rumble! Okay, so don't have to do this. Mega Ball Punch! Oof! You punch that bastard into the next time zone! Okay, we're gonna move. And then we're probably gonna move. Well, no, I don't really. Probably. Oh, we kill him. Congrats, super friends. Now you're gonna move Jimmy. Ready to pummel enemies at max speed. Go on, I don't want to get that guy. Oh, yeah, I guess I can. Great job, etc. etc. Well, hello, new child. I haven't seen you before, but you come at a crucial time. South Park is sliding into moral decline. Someone's stealing our cats. They're peeing houses. Okay, maybe it's not full on Armageddon yet, but we do need a hero. Not to make the heart sell, but. Do you see yourself as a good person? Oh yeah, it's alignment. Well, I can understand the confusion, but there comes a time when we need to choose our path. Will you find Jesus and take the righteous path? Or maybe you'll walk the middle way. Let's not talk about the third alternative. I'm hoping you're part of the solution, not the problem. Yeah, if I remember correctly, it's like you're uh... Take the first step, my child, by entering this you meditative remember, chamber, which will allow you to confront your deepest no. fears. Don't and face your fears, and you new know what the is. Face your fears. It was an old boy. A little bit. Well, I hope, uh, I no, hope your no, church no. wasn't like this. No. You're dead. Fuck your mom. You afraid of the dark? Snakes? The color blue? Ooh. Oh, hey. I'm in your imagination. Just a friendly Catholic priest who would like to get to know you a little better. Yeah, that's right. I'm totally in your imagination, too. About to give you a shoulder rub. Ever imagine you'd feel something like this? Let me adjust the lighting in here a bit so we can get some visuals with that. I hate it here. <laughs> yeah, no, this part's funny, but I'm like, oh God, the you know music what, kills You know me. what the joke, the reason why that joke is? What? What well, usually, um... Why, why priests mess with Dr. Voice? Is because in the Catholic religion, um, if you are in a higher power like priest, bishop thing, you are not supposed to be married to a, uh, a woman or be married to somebody because you're supposed to be married to the church and married to. So the whole running joke is because they don't get any oh, I guess this one likes action. Rough. No complaints here. Yeah, you do this. I guess you want to do it the hard way. I've got God's love here. Who am I going to give it to? Ha! 
Hide and seek, huh? Do I get a kiss if I find you? Oh, that priest likes kids a whole lot. You don't want to get caught in his hook. You might really need a towel there. <laughs> ah, oh, I like that. Please don't say you like it. Ah. Don't be shy. There's no reason to hide. Well, as I say, I've heard there's actual, like, real Oh, yeah, he'll prison, thing. all right. I don't know there is, but I, I, I've i never seen her. The priest left our church because he uh, actually got into a relationship. But he he took the church, before, he took the church, like, after it oh, started. Like, Cossack, before geez. it, like, really got started. So he resigned. Uh, oh, my. Let me get warmed up. Got him. Yeah. Okay, I would change my costume, but I feel like in this one it doesn't make a difference what you're wearing. God damn it! I can't put a child in a dark room for two minutes without you bastards showing up. Or you're definitely going to hell now. Get out of here! That's not what the Queen Spider says. I'll go say 10 Mel Harry's. Well, no, gosh, I feel just awful Harry's. about all that. Tell you what, a rabbi friend gave me this macaroni picture. In times of trouble and tribulation, use it to call upon the Prophet Moses. Good luck on your spiritual journey. I hate Prophet Moses. is pretty cool. Oh, yeah. Have you seen... No, you haven't seen the episode about Moses making the macaroni. It's in the first season, I think. New kid, you've done a decent job so far. Come back now to school. I think we should advance way. your character. I guess I can wait for it. I thought you liked beating up girls. Ah, yeah. Yeah. We're way too pretty for this. Fine. I took a little bit of venom to one to bring it down. You doing the crazy girls? Yeah. Well, she came up on me, so. Oh. Yeah. Oh wow, you guys seem really cool. Too bad we have to kick your ass. Fuck him up, new kid. Order up, cuties. Everyone, try to keep up. Yeah, I saw that coming. I'm gonna whoop you like my mama did my daddy, sweetie. Hello, they all <laughs> Another enemy? Grounded. I can get away with that, right? Here for an ass. <laughs> I can't even think about zingy tingy wings right now. Yeah, no, she came up on me, so I probably don't have to carry Go down, stupid. New kid, I like the way you punch. Let's take things back. Wait, I think there's another kid. Yeah. Dude, pace yourself. Even better about the fight. Everybody good here? Great. Yeah. Tough break, but hope. Swooping in on a breeze of justice. I need to Who's next? Now, who ordered the old-fashioned beating? Cold as hell? Here I go. I'm not even worried about Kyle, because he's going to be really good to go. I think that would be like, this one. I'm going to kill out of here. Because I'm like, I, I could just take her out. You move in one square? Yeah, I can. Part where the bad guys regret their life choices. Well, I said I just fought her, so she's running up on me. Yeah. So. Ah, new kid, come take a seat. 
All right, well, how's it going out there? I'm pretty good. Okay, good talk. Uh, well, listen, I think you show some potential, and uh, I'm going to upgrade you to somebody's sidekick or something. Congratulations. I just maybe wanted to talk about your superhero character a little bit. Um, your character sucks, to be honest, and I think I'm going to let you dual class. Let's pick another ability to add. Dual class. So what kind of skill set are you looking to add to your repertoire? Art. Psychic. Let's do it. Okay, oh, I think those two will work nicely bomb. together. But now we're going to need to change your uh, backstory, too. I said, uh, so let's go back again to that bomb. fateful night. I mean, back I could change it back, middle. but... You did lay awake that night, but the reason you couldn't sleep was because you wanted to make the world a safer place. You walked to the mirror. You looked in the mirror and wondered if anyone would ever love you. And then you heard a noise, but, but it was a baby crying. <laughs> Out in the hallway, you saw two guys attacking a helpless baby on the floor. You had to stop them from hurting that baby, didn't you? You knew you had the power to stop them, and so you called upon your newly discovered power! As a psychic superhero, you focused your mind and prepared for battle. Your foes had brawn, but you had brains. You used those brains to create a psi shield. You're just gonna sit there and faint, kid? What do you think of this? What the? What's with the kid? You sensed another threat coming from up the stairs. As the brute entered, you overpowered his weak mind with a dazzling flash. Scarcity. Here comes that one. What? First intruder tried his luck again. But his attack still couldn't penetrate your mental barrier. What is this power? Still under the influence of Mind Glitter, the biggest intruder attacked his fellow thug. Hey, hey, what do you think you're doing? I can't think at all. Now you've centered your mental energy to further trivialize your enemy's attacks. That's just not fair. The intruder still thought he could get a hit in on you. But he thought, man. I'm just out of ideas. Me too. Ugh. You were done toying. You focused your mental energy once more. You got into position to unleash a massive cerebral blast. Maybe brains are better than brawn. And so you beat them. You swept the baby up in your arms to take him somewhere safe, and then that's when the unthinkable happened. You saw your dad fuck your mom. And from then on, you had to live with the fact that because you were busy helping a baby, you could stop your mom from fucking your dad. Uh, perfect. That's heavy, man. Uh, I'm really sorry. I'm really not sorry. I know you probably want like to know why. Why your dad fucked go your mom, but those are answers you'll have to find for yourself. Cooney friends alert! Cooney friends alert! Seriously, guys, alert! Alert! The Cooney friends alert! This is Coon, what's happening? It's the Freedom Pal! What have they done now? Just get to Main Street! Hurry! We're coming! Coon! Ow! Well, new kid, looks like you might be needing those newfound powers. Follow me! <laughs> <laughs>